Before we start learning Premiere P6, I need to introduce to you some important concepts which you need to know so that you can easily understand the working of Premiere P6. So let's start. Premiere P6 is used for planning, tracking and managing projects or programs. It can be used as a standalone tool or as a web-based pro program or even as cloud-based now. It's usually used for creating project schedules, budgets and tracking project progress. The version of P6 which I am going to use for this course is P6 8.2. Let's have a look at the project structure in Primavera P6, how projects are structured. At the topmost level in Primavera P6, we have EPS or the Enterprise Project Structure. Under each EPS, we have different projects. And projects are further divided into WBS and then WBS are further divided into activities. Let's have a look at them one by one. EPS or Enterprise Project Structure It includes all programs or projects of an enterprise or an organization and it's structured according to the requirements of organization. For example, let's say we have a company in which we have manufacturing, construction and maintenance divisions. So, we may set up our Enterprise Project Structure in Primavera P6 such as manufacturing, construction and maintenance divisions and under each EPS we will have different projects. For example, projects of manufacturing will be under manufacturing EPS, projects of construction will be under their own EPS and so on. Project WBS WBS is called Work Breakdown Structure. As you can see on your right hand side of this screen, EPS has projects under it and each project has different WBS for it. Actually, a project is further divided into manageable small chunks of work or deliverables which are called WBS. For example, let's say we have a project to create a new mobile phone. We can divide this project into various WBS such as hardware, software and testing. WBS can be divided up to any number of levels, depends upon the requirements of project and the details we need. Now, what's a project? Project is a temporary endeavor undertaken to create a unique product or service. A project always has a definite start and an end. It is non-repetitive. Examples of projects include construction of new office building, creating a new software, manufacturing a new car with better mileage, etc. Activities or tasks. Each project in Primavera P6 has activities under WBSs. So WBSs are further divided into tasks or activities. These are the tasks that need to be performed to produce the deliverables for our project. For instance, under software WBS of our mobile phone project, we can have various activities such as writing the code, testing code, debugging, etc. Note that activities can be further broken down in P6 into subtasks or steps if such a detail is needed for our project. Here you can see in this figure I have shown you how projects are structured in Primavera P6. Let's say we have an EPS manufacturing and under this EPS we have various projects. And say one project we have is the Star Phone 1. Under this project Star Phone 1 we have different WBS of software, hardware and testing and under each WBS we will have different types of activities. So the activities will sum up to their parent WBS, the parent WBS will sum up to the higher WBS and finally to the project level. In our next lecture we will know how to create a project in Primavera P6.